Hey everyone, it's me. Thanks so much for joining me today. I love spending time with you. Thanks for spending time with me. Let's go ahead and get started as we learn about God's love for us together today. Let's go ahead and start with the Lord's Prayer. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. All right, I'm gonna try to build something today. Okay, um, I've got my cards here. I'm gonna try to build a house. Here's some walls, here's a roof, and oh, <laughs> I guess I need some sort of floor on the bottom, right, uh, for it to work. So let's try this piece of paper. I'm going to take this piece of paper and I'm going to take those two cards here and that's kind of working-ish. Oh, oh, not very strong, I guess. I guess I need something stronger. Okay, what do I have that's bigger and stronger? Um, oh, how about this? How about my Bible? Okay, I'm going to put my Bible down right here and then I'm going to take some cards and stand them up and see. Oh, there we go. Let's see if I can lift it up for you to see. There we go. The cards are doing a much better job now that they're on the Bible. Well, okay. For cards, you can set a house of cards on anything that's pretty stable, but I like this reminder because our lives need a foundation too. They need something at the bottom like a house to keep the house strong. You need a foundation to keep a house strong. And for our house of cards, we need a, a strong foundation. We need a strong foundation too. We need God's word. Uh, if we don't have God's word, then our lives can get pretty shaky. When people have questions or if I, we have questions or if things get kind of scary, if we don't have a firm foundation, we can feel pretty shaky. But with God's word, we know that we are loved by God and that Jesus died and rose and lives again for us. And we have a, a firm foundation in God's word. So let's go ahead and look today about a king uh, and how important it is to have God's word as the foundation of our lives. All right. The Bible verse today is from Psalm 95. O oh, come, let us worship and bow down. Let us kneel before the Lord, our maker. Okay, so you're going to have to learn that verse this week if you are, have been memorizing verses. O oh, come, let us worship and bow down. Let us kneel before the Lord, our maker. That's from Psalm 95, verse 6. Okay, you want to pray with me? Here you go. Dear Jesus, we need you as the foundation of our lives. Forgive us for trying to live without your forgiveness and love. You have promised to never let us go. Encourage us to come to you in prayer with our joys and troubles. In your name, amen. So this week, I hope you enjoy learning more about God's word. And as you read God's word, I hope you remember that Jesus, who is the heart of the Bible, is your foundation. All right. Bye.